Hello everyone and welcome back to the Pillar. My name is Miles and today I'm going to be building the house for our mountain fortress. Last time I went ahead and laid the groundwork for what I would eventually live in and today I want to flesh it out. I started by making the doorways. It seemed like the most logical place to start and I wanted to make them the center point of the house on either side so I knew how much space I had to work with for walling and things like that. I didn't want my house to be too tall, otherwise it would be taller than the towers, so the ceilings are a bit low down for my tastes, but for the sake of making the entire area look fitting, I didn't really have much of a choice. I chopped out the corner bits across from each other to put ladders up to reach my roof. And I began laying the groundwork for my stairs to go up to the second floor. Underneath the stairs, I built a cubby for me to use as a place to put the things that I'm not going to need on a day-to-day -day basis. Finishing the flooring, I put a railing around the outside of the staircase so as to not accidentally fall down it, and I began the walls for the second floor. After taking a look at the house, and thinking about the fact that I've used the same color wood for the entire thing, I decided to use the inner walls, I was going to build them out of a different color, just to add some contrast. Cutting out the portion that I decided was going to be my room, I then started to create a bit of a balcony. As I was building the actual roof to the entire structure, the thought of it all looking so similar still plagued me in the back of my mind, and it took me some time to figure out something that I could do to make it not look so boring. And 
then decided after I finished the roof I would do something about it. After cleaning up the bits of the roof that I couldn't reach from the inside, I go back in and I cut out my space for windows. I didn't want them overly tall, I just wanted small little slits, because I, since I already plan on being able to get on top of my roof, being able to see if things are outside my house really isn't going to be much of an issue. That with the glass door frame, to compensate the lack of windows on the first floor. I began roofing, and I decided to do a stone brick plate on the top of my house. I decided I was going to build a fence around it out of the stone brick again and actual fencing. finish up that bit, I had also decided that the base of the house needed to look more sturdy, and I would also assist with my contrast problem, so I replaced the first two bricks on the bottom from wood to the stone brick that I had used on the roof. And I began putting the ladders all the way up, and I wanted a way to my roof that didn't involve going outside, so I cut a hole from inside my room and laddered away up from there. After finishing off with the trap door, I decided I was finished with my actual house. That's it for this episode, guys. Next time, I'll be finishing the last tower and doing a little bit of cleanup on the things that I'm not quite satisfied with. Thanks for watching, everybody.